Hi, I'm Virus Walker and welcome to my channel. Today I have a surprise. I have a friend of mine, Will. Hi, I'm Will Scarfer from Will Banks. Yes, he lives in, on the area here. My, my good friend and yeah. went to school with my daughter. And he's very artistic. You would not believe the amazing things that this young boy does. It's just amazing. So I've, I'm very happy Thank to you. have you I'm in so here. I'm so excited to be here. And to be sharing with my followers how talented you are. Thank you. So why don't you tell me a little bit about your story? Like, what do you do? So I, um, I'm a performer by uh, night, I guess you could say. So um, I do shows in theatre and stuff like that, but I also have, have my own cake business. I will bakes underscore on Instagram. This little tag, I'll plug myself. Um, but I make cakes just like Veruska does. Um, I do lots of drip cakes and fun, trendy um, cakes that are really in at the moment, yeah. Well, we're gonna talk more about that because that's how I come across his website and I got to know that he make a cake. But he's very talented too on the Broadway and uh, yeah. so what are you, some of the very famous uh, plays that you do? So um, I've performed in plays like Beauty and the Beast which is like a Disney classic um, right now I'm doing an opera actually at the moment, um, an Australian opera um, and I've done things like Mary Poppins and Guys and Dolls and lots of really fun stuff. Yeah. What a very talented young man and what I love about you is your love for cake and my daughter and a friend of her told me that you like what I do and yeah. you watch my channel and I thought for me this as an artist there's nothing better to know that a young, young people right there is watching my videos and getting inspired and this young boy is amazing you have to check his website click like leave your comment and support this young Thank very you. talented boy so I started researching about the marshmallow. I'm Brazilian, Will. We grow up with a marshmallow that we call Maria Molly. So I wanted to do a cake, cakes with using the Maria Molly, but I wanted something to last a little bit more, especially in contact with the air. And that's how I come up with you, your website and I saw your recipe and I want you to share with me and my followers today so we can make in here and I can use all my other cakes. Fantastic. Yeah? yeah so awesome. we're gonna start. Will's recipe, what do you need? So the ingredients you're going to need for this recipe are two portions of half a cup of water, uh, three tablespoons of gelatin, two cups of sugar, just to break up the clumps a little bit and then you want to slowly drizzle um, the hot mixture into the gelatin. So then we're just going to turn that to top speed. And then you just want to let that whip for 8 to 10 minutes. 
So once the marshmallows get to um, this stage of, I guess you could say, fluffiness, you just want to add in your vanilla. Um, and it will splash up a little bit, but there we go. Perfect. So um, now that, whilst that's whipping, I've got some really, really cool silicon molds here that um, Veruska has prepared for me. And so I've just sprayed them a little bit. And then you just want to grab a brush and make sure that the oil is evenly distributed. This is just so the marshmallow mixture doesn't stick too much to the molds. You guys can see that it's really nice and fluffy. It's almost like um, a meringue. And so I'm just gonna transfer that into the piping bag and then we can start piping them and filling them up. Ooh. Gets so messy sometimes, hey? <laughs> oh my goodness, oh my too. goodness. I make a lot of this too, Will. Mum yells at me all the time, get in trouble. All right. Okay. So I'm just piping into um, the moulds. I've got some really cool brains moulds right here. <laughs> God knows where they're from. Will, I'm a collector. I'm always on a shop, a special secondhand shop, and I Absolutely. collect everything. But these ones, these heart ones, is from a, a Bake Boss. And I just fell in love because you can make this beautiful heart shape. So it sets pretty quick, it doesn't Yeah, really, absolutely, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Generally, um, you can leave them overnight for best results, but sometimes they only take, you know, two hours to yeah. set up. So you put in a refrigerator? Yeah, yeah, yeah. absolutely. Right. Let's see. All right, so I'm just gonna put a little bit of the color on yeah. the leftover you have in here. And I'm using Skin Tone from Magical Color, a gel color, because I wanted to make a llama. Yeah, fantastic. <laughs> so, Veruska's has just dyed um, some of the marshmallow mixture, this fantastic colour that she's going to make the mars marshmallows. Um, she's going to use these really awesome silicon ball moulds to make a really cool llama cake. So, um, I'll just fill up the piping bag and, um, yeah, we'll just fill them up. So, Will, I, I, my idea was because I wanted to make some uh, dilemma full of little balls, yeah. like I did my poodles. Fantastic <laughs> inspiration. No, it's really awesome. Um, because if you would do this with fondant, it would be too much. Yeah. Like you, it, it would be really heavy to make the, the, and you would never get this balls effect. So, so, so my inspiration came from uh, Catherine Sabah. Yeah, know, she's know. amazing, I Catherine know. Sabah. So yeah. I saw her ball cakes, and I thought, oh, this is an awesome idea, you know, and so. Yeah. So I you, get inspired too, you see? So you just fill these up and the so the tops of these doesn't really have to be completely perfect as they'll be um, pushed Behind up against the, the side right, of the cake they will yeah be against the cake so a lot of people are asking me oh, every time I uh, make marshmallow my marshmallow sticks uh, what do you do but not to stick so as you can see just by spraying a little bit of oil the ball Already wanted to come out. Doesn't yeah, it? super easy. You can also use a Crisco. Uh, yeah, Crisco is very good too. And if you're in a rush, I guess you could use butter. Um, not as good, but it does work. Yeah. yeah. All right, well, I love your recipe. I can't wait to try, but I'm gonna show you the Brazilian way. We love fast. We love anything Fantastic. that is fast and easy and quick to do. So no cooking involved in Perfect. here. So all you need is 250 ml of hot water, and I have two, two, 25 grams of gelatin. It's about five spoons of clear gelatin. So like you, I mix, I combine it this a little bit. Just so you don't have any big clumps. Yeah, yeah. the clumps, yeah. And then uh, we usually put the 500 grams of uh, sugar and that's it. Beat okay. until it gets creamy like you are. Perfect. But I'm going to add, like you mentioned before, a little sachet of gelatin because not only has color, it also has flavor. Beautiful, yeah. So I'm going to add 
one of those. And this is just regular jelly that you get from the store. Yes. Yeah. And something like you did. Uh, the only thing that it doesn't have in here is the um, glucose. Yeah. But, uh, Which I guess helps the marshmallow keep its gelatinous and the soft texture. Well, that is what I wanted yeah. to see. I wanted to can't wait to to see the texture and uh, see the difference. So uh, that's why I got so interested in um, ask you to come in here, do this video with me, and we see the difference. What it made you? become so interested about cake decorating. So when I was younger I watched lots of videos of cake decorating just like yours and um, I did come across some really awesome YouTubers and you know um, cake artists that make these amazing cakes like Cake Boss and now there's all these television shows that you know you can watch that are really awesome um, and so I was like well why don't I give it a go and I actually found that you know the best way of decorating cake and making a, uh, making a cake is to you know be your own and have your own unique way of making it you know the way I decorate cakes is different to a brusque would anyone would and it's just about being true to who you are and you know um, being creative as well I just found it fascinating when young people, you know, a young man like you, showing so much interest for the a whole Archie, and you are mixing Archie. He's in some way mixing Archie, all his uh, creative and um, Don't ask. performance. Uh, uh, to create his cake, yeah. so you are mixing art. Absolutely. Yeah. Don't ask me to make a painting because it'll be terrible. But you know, cake decorating, I guess, is a form of art, and you know, it's something unique, and not everyone can do it. So, um, but it is really special. Yeah. Well, I'm very pleased, and I I can see a great future for you. Thank I you. Really Thank can. you, very scott I think you go do wonders. But when you get too famous, don't forget. <laughs> I won't. <laughs> You can see, uh, Will, that mine is more softer than yours because yours have the glucose. So I think that's the biggest difference in here is on the... Um, Mine's a lot firmer. That's right. So I think when we try, because of course we're going to have yeah. to test. So when we try, you're going to see that yours is very much like a marshmallow consistent and mine is more uh, melt. It will yeah. melt practically on your in your mouth but uh, practically exactly the same so I'm just gonna pour this straight in yeah but of course if I wanted to do on the little balls I probably would do like you did I put on a piping bag and these recipes are really great because, you know, you see marshmallows and you see them as quite a really intricate um, sort of recipe, whereas when you try it, it's quite easy and, um, you know, and it's really great, quite cheap to make too. Is it nice? Yeah, delicious. <laughs> yeah, I'll have a little bit too. Mm, it's really beautiful. Yeah. yeah. And you get that raspberry flavor from that. You have no idea. When we have kids in Brazil, everybody must have this you yeah. know and yeah, i remember my mother usually they put on a rectangle uh, cake pan or tupperware and the refrigerator for a couple of hours like you say and then they cut in little squares and then put on the uh, coconut so just like marshmallows yeah and every kids party has one wow. we always have Maria Molly That's on awesome. the table so it make me come back even the smell make me a member of Brazil yeah so, yeah and home yeah yeah so do you just let this to sit for that's right two hours three hours yeah and it, it will become a very firm like this one and this one I put coconut on the outside as you can see yeah delicious coconut yeah yeah, with the coconut. Some of my friends even put the coconut on the recipe. Yeah, so they mix yeah. The coconut on the recipe. And it gives too. great texture inside That's right. the right. So when you bite yeah. it, it has the crunchy. So you can also um, cover them in an icing sugar uh, corn flour mixture, and that gives it, you know, the classic marshmallow sort of um, uh, taste with my ones. Yeah. Okay. All right, you ready? Uh huh. Hello, I'm Verusco Walker. Welcoming to my channel. <laughs> <laughs> no. um, so I'm gonna have a go at Veruska's um, marshmallow recipe. So um, should I just start 
Yeah. Doing it all. It's so, so hard to. <laughs> yeah. So <laughs> difficult. Yeah. Yeah. So just warm water, gelatin, yep. sugar. Give that a quick whip. So we've gotten the uh, marshmallows out of the refrigerator and they're really easy to pop out just like this. Um, we've also we, got, yeah. yeah. we decorate your lamb in here with the leftover of the marshmallow. The llama, yeah. A lamb. You said lamb. <laughs> <laughs> it, do, it could yeah. be a lamb. We decorate the llama. And yep. um, we just use the leftover marshmallow and we put it in it. And it, it looks good. It just does, yeah, it is, fantastic. Huh? And in fact, I, I think you could even pipe in some big blocks. Yeah, absolutely. On a, uh, on a llama or even lamb. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, we're going to use all the little balls that we we uh, made before so it's quite simply like because the marshmallow is still very sticky so you just keep putting your balls there and you, it sticks to you or you can use a little bit of a uh, toothpick and shove it and in yeah. yeah so you leave a little bit outside because when it dries then we can remove yeah, things absolutely yeah. and also if you don't want to put it on a cake or anything you can just get some coconut or you can use um you know icing sugar and like they do classically in the packets and just dip them in quickly and then there you go ready to eat oh, yeah no. but we'll put them on the cake yeah, yeah perfect so, the moment of the trudging here for us is this is the ones you made yeah yeah these ones recipe. here and yeah. that's the one i made yeah so we should we have to see the dvc we only put on a refrigerator for what? An hour, hour? yeah. So, but uh, Will's is quite, look, it's like a marshmallow. And Bruce, because you can see, is quite, um, not as thick, but it is a really beautiful. Watery. Yeah. So, yeah, mine, when you put it in your mouth, it melts. Yeah, yeah. Uh, as yours. As it's you more would. of a traditional marshmallow sort That's of. That's right. Yeah, yeah. As you would, you know, at a, bar at a barbecue but or something like that. But both will work exactly the same, and um, they're both delicious because yeah. they're just pure sugar. Yeah, <laughs> basically, yeah. But uh, it's up to you what you wanted to do. Actually, I wanted to try. Mm -hmm. Mm. It's really so delicious. Good. And the vanilla, yeah. the vanilla makes such a really difference. Really comes through, yeah. Mm. And this one, mm. <laughs> no, it's really delicious. The coconut definitely gives it a bit of a lift. Yeah, I love the coconut mm. yeah, because the Maria Molly that I told you in Brazil has we coconut. always put on the yeah. coconut yeah it's really beautiful. For my little poodles, I put coconut all over outside. So I thought with this llama we should do the same thing. We put all the balls on the llama and then I'm gonna uh, cover in coconut. Yeah. So you get they almost look like a Fair. hair. Yeah, 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 beautiful. So me and you will we're gonna keep going in here and keeping decorated this llama. Well, it was such a pleasure to thank meet you. you. Thanks for having thank me. Thank you so much to come in here and share your story. And um, I can't wait to see the good things that is coming to your life. I think you uh, have a great future. And uh, I'm going to see you on the Broadway. Uh, Broadway? <laughs> yeah, Broadway, yeah. And movies, maybe? Yeah, yeah, hopefully. Yeah. yeah. You have to check it out to his YouTube channel. Go there, show your support because he's a very young, talented man in here. Thank you. Yeah, I can't believe how much you grow up. <laughs> <laughs> I know. No kidding. I have this mess behind you right now. <laughs> yeah. And he is just taking over. Yeah. So all the best for you, you and thank you so much to support my videos. And if you are at home and you like Will and you love what I do and you are very talented too, young person. Please write for me. Maybe we could be doing a video together too. Absolutely, just like we did here. Yeah. yeah. Thank you, Thank Will. You for and may, me. maybe they can uh, contact you too. Yeah, absolutely. And, yeah, because yeah. I have my own business as well, so you can contact me, uh, Willbex underscore on Instagram. I will yeah. have all the details under this video. Yep. Awesome. Let's get on to it. Yeah.
So if you remember of my uh, letters and numbers that I have before, these little marshmallow balls go perfect on top of the little cupcakes. They're just gorgeous and will be a part of heaven.